As we reach the halfway point of the 2019 Fordham football camp, it's time to move from the offense to the defense as we continue our position-by-position position look at the Rams with the defensive line. Fordham entered the 2018 season with very little experience on the defensive line as the two deep was stacked with freshmen and sophomores. The good news is that those players gained experience that will benefit the Rams this fall. The Rams return all four starters in the line, led by junior Anthony Diodato, who started all 11 games at defensive end, recording 34 total tackles, including 3.5 for loss. Junior Ellis Taylor also returns to the line after appearing in all 11 games as a sophomore, making 25 total tackles, including 5.5 for loss and 2.5 and sacks. Junior Jeremy Imperati saw action in all 11 games as a sophomore, starting four on the defensive line. He recorded 21 total tackles, including 5.5 for loss and 2.5 and sacks. Also returning to the line is junior Michael Marinelli, who appeared in all 11 games, starting nine at nose tackle for the Rams as a sophomore. He registered 12 total tackles, including two for loss, and had one pass breakup. Junior DeAndre Carter saw plenty of action last fall, appearing in all 11 games on the line for the Rams, starting six. He had 33 total tackles, including three for a loss and one sack. Other returning players with experience include junior Sawyer Swartz, who saw action in six games as a sophomore, recording eight total tackles. Sophomore Gavin Watson, who appeared in three games as a freshman, making two tackles. Sophomore Alfonso Dixon, who appeared in five games as a freshman, making three total tackles. Sophomore Luke Simon, who saw action in two games as a rookie. And senior Anthony Solano, who moves back to the defensive line after appearing on the offensive line last year. Newcomers to the line include Jonathan Jonathan Coste, a transfer from ASA College where he made 17 tackles last year, including six and a half for loss and one sack. Elisha Armstrong, a Herald News All-Area pick at Bolingbrook High School in Bolingbrook, Illinois. Deshaun Dixon, a 2018 First Team All-Golden League selection at Antelope Valley High School in Lancaster, California. John Turley, a product of Malvern Prep in Malvern, Pennsylvania. And Tom Callahan, who played his high school football at Seton Hall Prep in New Jersey. So about a week and a half into camp now, Jeremy, how's it going? Uh, it's going pretty well. Um... We're doing well, we're recovering, you know, we're lifting, we're practicing, you know, we're trying to get better every day, stack good days on top of good days. Uh, about 17 days out from our first game, so we're just trying to prepare for that. Now, last year you came you know, came to camp, the defensive line pretty much had no experience. You had yeah. a bunch of freshmen and yeah. sophomores. This year, you still don't have a lot of upperclassmen, yeah. but there's that experience. How important is that? That's very team? important in the group. Um, we got a, a good group of young guys. They're learning, they're hungry to learn. Um, we got about five guys returning that got significant playing time, so I mean, that's awesome to have experience on the line. We're only juniors, but I mean, we got experience playing, so that's fine. Now, halfway through camp, how sick are you of hitting your own teammates? <laughs> you know, I we're, we're real sick of it, but you know, we got to get the job done. I can't wait for the August 31st when we play Central.